the frame okay. this one. That's it. Hey, he has a camera. And Papa, what's this? Okay, one more. Happy birthday for the camera. Yeah. Okay. Strike the pose. 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 Dit is Harry Blommestein, artiest. En Rosetta, mijn moeders favoriete boek. Ik zie niks. Ik zie niks. Nou, we even voorstellen aan wat mensen wij dit is Norbert Artiest, Piet Artiest. Hij is schilder, hij is pianeur. Hans is groot, groot ondernemer. Groot ondernemer. Hij is ook artiest. Hè? Ik ben fotograaf ja. en okay. ontwerper. En Eddie Woods, wel, die kennen we. Wat are you? Poet. Writer. Poet. Writer. Writer. Okay. Vera de Vries. Ja, Vera de Vries. Vera de Vries. Dit zijn de twee Vera's. Twee Vera de Vries. Ja. Dit is mijn grote vriendin Dia. We hebben net gisteren weer naar huis. Oh, wat is het heerlijk, hè? Slecht dat we blijven lachen. Nee, nee, het is een video. Film. We have a roast Mediterranean veg with burger rice. Okay. We have got some beautiful uh, North African with couscous. That's got some apricots, some dates, some mint, some coriander. We've got an Indian um, coconut and mango salad, and this is a beautiful vegetable frittata. And for the benefit of the tape, my hands are nice and clean. The Frying Dutchman. The Frying Dutchman. <laughs> and, where, and this is Paul. He is from Scotland and from Glasgow, which is very difficult to understand him if he speaks with. Oh, we still, get used to it. Yeah, but he has so much energy. So uh, he, he does. Uh, he's a musician. He's a great cook. 
and he's one of them who helped me uh, change my diet. Jamie Oliver helped us also. He found the, the recipes mm -hmm. for vegan and vegetarian dishes. But don't worry, Rafi stood here for seven hours cooking meatballs and chicken wings <laughs> and, and goat. So you can do everything you want. And uh, thank you everybody for being here. Come and join us. I think now we can dig in. It's Thursday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Dat is de bedoeling. Philip meet uh, tuna fish. Yeah, amazing number of uh, amazing number of. Uh, I saw an awful lot of women with beautiful cars. Ja, ja, ja. Ja, ja, ja. Ja, ja, Ik dacht dat het een
You are the apple of our eye. Forever you'll be in our heart. Yesterday our life was lonely. And then you came to our rescue. I must confess that this is heaven. How can so much love be inside of you? Oh, you are the sunshine of our life. Yeah, that's why we'll always be around. You are the apple of my eye. That's why we'll always keep you in our hearts. You are the sunshine. You are the sunshine of our lives. The sunshine of our life. Our life. Our life.
dicht bij elkaar. Nog iets dicht bij elkaar. Doe het dicht bij elkaar. Ik doe het dicht bij elkaar. Ik denk dat we weer 20 kilo of zo. Ik heb gewoon kus van. Ja, ik heb het. Nog één keer, nog één keer. Goeie hug, een broek hug. Sorry. Stand behind. And I show you this. Yeah. Not on Facebook, that is. I got bigger heels. Yeah. 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 Gertrude Stein, which was a salon mistress, and, and to me, her spirit is really one of sharing, opening her home, and I've met so many wonderful people and so many wonderful things have happened through this quality. I became very interested in Jewish stories and their deeper meaning, and um, there's a body of Jewish literature called um, Midrashim, and a Midrash is a story about a story in the Bible. So I wrote a number of, of stories, and I thought I would maybe share this one with you. <laughs> and that's when Eve popped in. She was beautiful. And Adam wasn't lonely anymore. And the two did so many things together. They would take long walks on the beach. They would swim in the water. They'd play games like leapfrog, hide and go seek, and scrabble. And the snake lured Eve behind the tree. And when she got there, she couldn't believe what she was seeing. The snake was standing beside a lovely, large, bright green apple computer. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Eve had never seen a computer before and she didn't know what to do. She was really confused. She, she, she pushed one button and then another and another, but ooh, within a couple of minutes, oh, she'd learned how to do programs like WordPerfect 6.0. She'd learn how to fax, how to type a mailing list of a thousand, how to email. In short, Eve was obsessed. Now, meanwhile, poor Adam was frantically running through the jungle looking for Eve everywhere. And he followed it behind the tree, and he could see Eve typing away at her, at her computer. He said, Eve, it's Adam, your man. I've been worried about you. But she was in no mood for him. She said, oh, would you shut up? I've been trying to figure out the maximum amount of vegetables we can grow within the smallest given radius. <laughs> and she kept typing and typing away. Really, poor Adam didn't know what to do, but the snake did. He said, say that, Adam, you sexy hunk of a guy. Why don't you try this here Macintosh? And fixed him behind a computer, too. And Adam also became obsessed. And from that day on, all the two of them ever wanted to do was work at their computers. And at night, when the stars twinkled in the sky and the moon <coughs> drenched them in moon glow, they were just too tired to feel it. And in this particular way, they could never again go back to the garden they were born into. And that's the end of that story. Thank you. <laughs>